you can easily see the anthesis going on at our BHU research field at about 10 o'clock morning. You can see very well that the flow rate which is opening, the flow rate which is opening, how this anthers are coming out, the filaments elongates, anthers burst inside the inside the spikelet, inside the spikelet and empty anthers are coming out. You see, after some time, you see the the open floret see the open floret very closely it's op it's 10 o'clock morning here in bhu varanasi as i said earlier that it starts emphasis is start in, in the morning in northern india at about 10 o'clock and it goes up to 2 o'clock the maximum emphasis takes place during 11 to 12 o'clock. So, by 2 p.m., there will not be any emphasis. So, one can start emasculation after 2 o'clock. So, you see the pattern, the mechanism of emphasis in rice how the florets are opening the uh, filaments are elongating and anthers are bursting inside leaving maximum pollen grain inside uh, forcing the cell pollination in rice and then Empty anthers are now outside. So after anthesis, it takes around 15 to 20 or sometimes 30 minutes to close the uh, spikelet. The spik spikelets are closing. After that, anthesis. So, leaving outside the empty anthers and the filament and after few days you will be finding the dried anthers and filaments uh, are removed, dried and removed by the wind and other things. So, this I wanted to show all of you the opening of anthesis and opening of uh, lama and pelia of the spikelet and then after some time closing it. So this is going on in my field at 10 o'clock. So you can see in Many plants you can see that this is going on in the morning. Yeah. So, florets are opening. You see, the florets are opening and this will close after some time. It will close after 15, 20 or up to 30 minutes it will be closing. So after 24 hours, there will be fertilization and development of zygote. And that, then after 30 days, the mature seed you will be getting. So this is all about 
the antithesis in rice.